Let the universal set S have 96 elements. Set A contains 37 elements, and the total number of elements in either set A or set B is 56. The sets A and B have 11 elements in common. How many elements are contained in set B? Let's begin by recording the given information. The universal set S has 96 elements, and therefore the cardinality of set S is equal to 96. Set A contains 37 elements. The cardinality of set A is equal to 37. The number of elements in either set A or set B is 56, which means the cardinality of A union B is equal to 56. And then we're also told sets A and B have 11 elements in common, which means the cardinality of A intersect B is equal to 11. I'll now let's record the information in the Venn diagram below. Let's begin with the intersection of set A and set B, which is this set here. Because set A and B have 11 elements in common, or because the cardinality of A intersect B is 11, we know we have 11 elements in this set here. Next, we also know there are 37 elements in set A. So here's set A. We already have 11 elements here in set A. And since 37 minus 11 is 26, we know there are 26 elements only in A, and therefore we can place a 26 here. Again, we have 37 elements in set A, 26 are only in A, 11 are also in B. And we also know there are 56 elements in either set A or set B, or there are 56 elements in A union B, which is this set here. Because we know there are 56 elements in this set, and we already have 26 elements only in A, and 11 in the intersection of A and B, we can determine the number of elements only in set B by taking 56 and subtracting the sum of 26 and 11. Well, 26 plus 11 is 37. So if we take 56 and subtract 37, we get 19. There are 19 elements only in B. And now to complete the Venn diagram, let's determine the number of elements that are not in set A and not in set B. We know the universal set has 96 elements, so if we take 96 elements and subtract the number of elements in this union, which we know is 56, we get 40. There are 40 elements not in set A and not in set B, but in the universal set. And now let's answer the question. The question is how many elements are contained in set B? Well, here's set B. There are 19 plus 11 or 30 elements in set B. I hope you found this helpful.